Hey, what's up? It's your girl Zamora, and today, as you can tell by in the title, I'm going to be talking to you all about basically when these men don't want you, sis. So, with that being said, let's get right into the video. First things first, inconsistency. Pay attention to if he checking in one day, then he goes MIA for days. Then you don't hear from him again till three, four, five days later, three even weeks sometimes. Sis, he don't want you. Period. Another thing. Lack of communication. If a man is for real about you or he's serious about you or if he wants you, he gonna communicate that. You are not going to have to wonder if he wants you or not. He's going to let you know he wants you. He's going to communicate that. He's going to be open and available to you. And with communication, I'm going to say, I'm going to go right off the bat and say, if he's closed off. If he's closed off, sis, he don't want you. Because I feel like if you want somebody, you're going to take that risk and open up. How you want somebody if you're not even opening up to them? You're not even giving them a chance to get to know you because you're so closed off. And you're not willing to be vulnerable with that person. Sis, he don't want you. He may want the idea of you. He may think he wants you. Or he may even have you thinking that he wants you. But sis... He don't want you. If you got a question, what his intentions are, he don't want you. A real man gonna let you know up front. Look, can I take you to dinner? Look, I'm calling. When are you free? He gonna be on you like white on rice because he wants you. So these are some of the things just like if you're wondering, if you're not sure, if you're questioning like, does he really want me? No, he doesn't. I feel like if you have to question it or if you have to wonder, if you're not certain and 100% sure that he wants you, he doesn't. Simple. I feel like sometimes we may complicate things or we may play into the games that some of these men like to play. Mm -mm, sis, send him on his way. Either send him on his way or put him in the friend zone. Um... Sometimes they may not be a bad guy. They just may not want you. <laughs> like, you finna be in the friend zone. Because I'm going to date and I'm going to be with somebody who wants me. And who's not afraid to show that they want me. They're not afraid to vocalize that they want me. I don't have time to be playing games up here wondering, oh, if he's going to want me today, but he didn't want me yesterday. Oh, he didn't want me yesterday, but he want me today. Oh, he may want me this week, but I don't know about next week. Or he may want me half of this week, but maybe not half of the next week. No, no, sis. He don't want you. Period. All these playing games, mixed emotions. You telling me this this week, you telling me that that week. No, it's the lack of consistency for me. You got to go. Because you playing and you holding up the line. Next, know your worth. Never settle. Don't let up. Period. You ain't even got to be no hard body or be mean. Just vocalize the fact that he don't want you and he can keep it pushing or he can go play games with somebody else because you're not the one, sis. Simple. When a man wants something, he going to get it and he going to let you know that he wants you. Period. Y'all know how many times, y'all know y'all be having the men chasing y'all, the ones that chase y'all and that knows they're going to let you know they're vocalizing that they're they're behind you like they letting you know like i'm not playing sis like i want you i'm not playing with you <laughs> so i feel like you know the real truth and sometimes we may question ourselves or sometimes we may want this man to want us hell we may want him but the fact that he don't want you sis it's not gonna work so it's time to stop wasting time it's time it's time to stop straddling the fence sis he don't want you let me grab my notebook, make sure I grace over everything. Oh, another thing, not taking the initiative. If he's not taking the initiative in what y'all got going on, he's not trying to take the initiative, like, baby, ask me on a date. Let me know 
open your mouth. I can't read your mind. I can't do the, you're not a little child. Use your words and use your words wisely. When it comes to a real woman, he gonna step up and he gonna do what needs to be done or he gonna have to get to step. Period. Move out the way for a real one to come through because you, you're not, they're not gonna keep wasting our times. No. Mm -mm. And the BS, basically, the BS is. Basically, I already went over that. It sums up everything from the inconsistency to the lack of communication, all of that. In me, y'all, I'm huge on communication. If you can't communicate, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to be with you at all because that is huge. I don't know what you got going on unless you tell me that. So if you're not verbalizing what I need you to verbalize, I don't have time to be sent here playing mind games. I'm not a psychic. I don't know what you got going on. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know where your mind is. I don't know what, what are your intentions. If I don't know those things, you need to keep it moving because you don't want me. And sis, if you need to know those things, you need to keep it moving, sis, because he don't want you. Period. He don't want you. It's just that simple. Sometimes we complicate things when there's no need to. Oh, that's another one. If he has you confused. There's no confusion when it comes to somebody who wants you. Period. Simple. So, with that being said, I hope you all got something from this video. Comment, like, subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next one. Until then, Z is checking out. Feel free to check out my other videos and my other sit-downs. Love y'all. Later.